open the main stage here at Fandom, and you're on a slightly bigger stage than the last time you were here. Yeah, yeah, slightly. How did it go? <laughs> it was my favourite show I've ever played in my entire life. I would second that. Well yeah. done. Cheers. It's quite a grand play. <laughs> you just knock it near Yeah, it was genuinely incredible. Um, we kind of when we when we got booked for the first on the main stage, we were all we were kind of nervous. Like we get nervous when we book headline shows as well. We don't know if anyone's going to come. You see it grow. We're still on stuck life. in that rut, aren't we? Thinking that no one actually likes our band. Yeah. Like it's a joke that's got out of hand. <laughs> yeah. But they. Yeah. Actually, yeah. The people they came out in their droves, uh, and it was incredible. Like they, the crowd, the crowd makes a show for us now because we play the same every night, pretty much. I think. You know, we're uh, quite tight, and well rehearsed, but. You know, we, we gauge a show on how the crowd is and they just fucking leave Better than Leeds yesterday? I think the I think we played better today. Yeah, we, we played a few better. technical difficulties yesterday, but it's, the crowds were equally great. Yeah. Outside and indoor, so difficult to compare. Yesterday seemed like an actual proper gig, today was like a genuine festival in the Weather helps. Of course the weather helps. It's glorious today. I mean you were saying just now about kind of Getting nervous, do you feel pressure being the first on the stage? You just to kind of treat you like any other gig, no matter what spot you play? I think if we start to overthink it, we're probably thinking we would pressurise ourselves, but we, we tend not to do that. Uh, we tend not to kind of overthink anything, we just kind of go into it. It's like we wake up, we're like, what do we do today? Play the show, sound, go on. Do Stressing it. out just makes you play bad and make mistakes, and yeah. we just don't stress out. People think we're like we don't care because <laughs> we just kind of come across like we're like, yeah, yeah. whatever. <laughs> but we do, yeah. it works for us doing that. <laughs> yeah. It makes you proper rock stars having an attitude like that, doesn't it? Well, <laughs> is there such a thing as a proper rock star in 2014? <laughs> I, would, I would say that. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. I mean, you've, you've got a huge following on Twitter. Do you think you are any good success on social media? I think it just helps, doesn't it? I think it's nice for people to be able to get in touch with us and to keep up to date with stuff that we're doing. You know, they used to have to search and sort of scrape to find when a tour was or you know what you were doing, and you, now you can just announce anything to everyone like that. Blink of an eye. So yeah, that's great. That helps. Yeah, we always try and. Uh, what you guys to change? Uh, yeah. uh, sorry. 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 Um, I did it first. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we, we, we make a, a real effort to interact with our fans on, on social media and, and, and you know, make it feel like they're part of, sort of, part of the band, um, which they are really, for them, they're really cool. Way to know what yeah. Do you feel that's important then? Oh, absolutely, yeah. You can't, you can't just... You know, you see some bands don't interact on, with their fans on Twitter and something, that's fair enough, but at the same time, like, we value our fans um, really. I got more benefit now, so um, to go out of our way to ignore them would be like so, so, we, we, we get the notification on our phone, questions and shit, why would we not reply? Yeah. It takes two seconds. Like that, I guess. <laughs> um, and several radio stations have also played this band, right. um, despite that, it's probably the first time that a lot of people would have heard of stuff. Um, yes. How would you describe your sound? Something that happened there? I think it's nostalgic. Is it? Yeah, maybe. Nostalgic. I think it's like rock music predominantly, but it's kind of more like, I guess, like progressive and like radio friendly in terms of like where we're sort of aiming to go with it. We don't really, we don't, like, I don't shout or scream, so I guess it's kind of like radio friendly rock. But I don't know that kind that of sounds, sounds like sounds awful. It sounds like cookie cutter. I don't like that question. I think that question is just impossible to answer. I think, yeah. I think you know, to describe your band, it's like, I think we're good, you might not. You might not. You should just say, yeah, I think, I think we're good, you might not. Check us out and see. Yeah, because you can't, you can't, you know. I bet you think we're great. <laughs> Ten. Beta. Um, as you mentioned just now, you guys have been playing on the What do you love? Everything. <laughs> Everything. Catching with friends. Well, first and foremost, catching catch with friends. Uh, you know, a lot of American bands we've toured and played here. Uh, we've There's played, so many people here, don't we? We've played with every band here, which just goes to show that we've been here for so long. Um, <laughs> kind of just know everyone. Um, we all the organisers and stuff, we've done it so many times. You know, it's, it's, it's nice to finally be at a stage where 
we've got a decent slot, um, which we've never really had before. But yeah, I like this best festival party of your life. What's that? Like, cool. <laughs> Why are you here? There she is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've been there. That's why we're putting it on. You said about like, being friends with the bands or the big bands that you're looking forward to seeing today. You've got the crowd, who's my pass. Let live. Uh, I'm glad that we're actually getting to play because we can go to every, we're at every day so we can see different people on every day because I think if we only went to one, you can't see everyone, that we, I can personally can't see everyone that I want to see, there's too many bands. Marvel's Head, Selecti, Decade, Natives versus Kids in Glass Houses, Let Live, We Are The In Crowd, Mallory Knox, I want Mercury Jackson maybe. I want to see the Ataris as well. The Ataris, yeah. There's, there's so many clashes and stuff. But Too many to, bands. We get to see everyone. So well, it's good. I've got to memorise the entire line-up. That's everyone who's on my little time sheet. <laughs> 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 um, if people haven't been able to make it down to Sandbox today, um, what other Exactly. I was going to say it, but I'm not that. <laughs> <laughs> if they haven't been able to come down, what other festivals can you uh, what are you doing for the rest of the year? Honestly, Hyde Park, Black Sabbath, 2000 Trees, Yard Fest, Nass Festival, Yard Fest, Why Not but, Festival, Why Not Festival, Butzer Fest, every oh, yeah. single festival that you've <laughs> ever seen posted on the internet. We're there, Camden Crawl, uh, literally everything. We're, we're booked every weekend now until maybe 2017. <laughs> it's a tough life, isn't it? Why, <laughs> mate? That's quietly interesting. Right, well, thank you very much for chatting to us. What a welcome. Enjoy the rest of the sun, It sounds like you've got a, a packed afternoon. Yes. <laughs> I suppose that's the pros of being on first. It is, yeah. yeah. Having the whole day to chill get, out. Get